Competition for food and territory is the driving force behind predator conflict in the wild. In Laikipia in Kenya, growing tensions between the rising numbers of predators often result in ferocious fighting taking place a bit too close to home for Fabi Harris. From our house, we would often hear hyena battles taking place, and every now and then they would meet and sort of establish territory. Hyenas aren't the only predators in the area. The wild dog population in the region is flourishing. Fabi's husband, John, spotted a pack of dogs on his way to work one morning. So he called me on the radio, Papa One Three, Papa One Three, do you want to come see the wild dog? So, yes! So I uh, jumped out of bed, still in pyjamas and bunny slippers, grabbed binoculars, video camera, jumped in the car, tore off down the hill and saw this pack of wild dog quickly, quickly run across the road. And we were very happy with that. And we turned the car around at the bottom of the hill and started to come back up again. Now we're looking at the dam wall and something comes up, so look in the binoculars, and it's this beautiful hyena, and another one comes over, and two fluffy juveniles, and just beautiful, so you think, wow, wild dog and hyena one day, that's really great. And then they start sniffing the air. Immediately, the rival hunters became aware of each other. But all hell broke loose on, on the damn wall. There was just this chattering noise as these wild dog were now actually going for the hyena. They literally formed this perfect circle around them, and they're launching these attacks. The two hyenas eventually land up back to back, fending off these attacks from the wild dog. Somehow, one of the hyena got separated from the other, and it really now is getting attacked. And he's swinging around, trying to fend them off, and they were taking it in turns to just come in and bite and bite. You can just see teeth. He was eventually holding his rump underneath him, dragging it over these rocks to try and protect himself from their bites. It's absolutely frightening, and I think I'm going to see a 10 wild dog absolutely rip a hyena to pieces. Luckily, the two juvenile hyena just at that point come back. These wild dog, as a group, they decided that four hyena versus 10 wild dog was not favorable and they needed to retreat. In weight class alone, the wild dogs were now outnumbered by their heavier opponents. There was this one bark and a few more hesitant advances. The hyena limped off down the valley and the wild dog have gone over the wall and two or three of them stop at the top of the wall and look back at us and for a split second through this video screen I'm thinking, oh no! <laughs> Are they going to come for us now? Uh, but obviously they weren't. And there was this one more sort of trumpeting bark from the one, and then they turn and, and go as well. And we just left there thinking, wow, you know, this is the most incredible thing to see. Encounters between different predators is something that comes up quite often. They encounter each other over food or while out hunting or even when the other predator is asleep. Tensions rise higher than ever when food is scarce. They are a competition in a way, and they will try and kill them, but they're not killing them to eat them. It's just physically to hurt it. 